know some booties in Cali, they all be calling me daddy. I know some hoes out in Texas, they all be showing affection. What's up, you guys? Welcome back to the channel. If you are new, do yourself a favor, subscribe, hit that bell notification, come join the team, cause we getting baddies over here. All right, today's video, she is testing you at all times. You think I'll pass on that? I don't know why I filled it out like she's getting tested when it's you getting tested. She basically, okay, here, take the test. Anyways, um, yeah, man, she's testing you at all times. She's always trying to see if you're really who you pretend or claim to be, who you claim to be, or if you're pretending. So, yeah, anyways, she's trying to see if you really Alpha Annie, if you really him if you really that dude that she wants to spend time with, wants to hang out with, wants to brag to all her girlfriends. Girl, you won't believe. Yeah, it's really like, whoa, you know what I'm saying? He be going crazy, and then he really like, you know what I mean, be doing his own thing. He be doing his, I be wondering where he's at. He always got baddies with him. He got a whole roster. How'd he learn that? Girl, I think he might have been watching winning with the women. I'm not sure. And then, like, he smelled really good. Like, he really got that magnetic on. Um, he got it from the link in the description. Best man come on for another hundred dollars. <laughs> Look, man, she gonna test you. She gonna, she gonna see if you really got what it takes to make her chase you. I know you're thinking like, bro, why would why would she want me to make her chase me? You know what I'm saying? What does she want to be chased? Because a lot of women, I see it all the time, especially on social media. I'm not going to take the man. I don't know why men think that they the woman and that they deserve to be chased. Look, women are meant to chase a man. They want to. Not on a logical level, on a biological and emotional level. They want to. They want to feel like they earned you. They got the man that every woman wants, that every woman desires. If they could do that, it's like winning the Olympics. You know what I'm saying? So you have to make yourself desirable at all costs. No slowing up, no, you know, Nah, I could chill. I could I could just be a little simpy. I could, you know, just cater to her and kind of just chase her and pursue her. I was on a call earlier today. If you have not booked a call, first link in the description, book a Zoom call. Let's talk about whatever you got going on. I was on a call and this dude was talking about, yeah, man, shout out to him. Uh, I had to cut her off, you know, because she didn't want to, you know, move forward. I was like, all right, well, were you doing most of the pursuing? Well, yeah, and you know, I mean, she only, you know, only called me like one time, but you know, that's not even the point. The point is, you know, I, I was like, hold on, brother. What you mean the point is? The point is, you was doing too much. He was telling me how she, she likes him and does see a future and wants to take it serious, move forward and all of this. Even said, I love you, all of that. But something was holding her back, holding her back because in her head, she's like, why does he want me so much? Like way more than I want him. Like I really actually do want him. I'm really attracted, but it's just like, I don't know, it's a red flag. It's, it's a red flag to women. When you are pursuing them, overly pursuing them, they get turned off because then they start to like think like, does he not have options? Does he not have other things going on in his life that he prioritizes? Does he not have friends? Does he not have family members? Does he not have a career that he's pursuing? Does he not have anything else? And that's gonna scare her, you know what I'm saying? It's gonna scare her because then she's gonna be like, well, if I get with him, then he's just gonna be all over me all the time, blowing up my line. It's probably gonna be this times 10. So she's scared she's keeping her distance, right? We always want them to be doing more pursuing than we are doing towards them. That way, you know what I'm saying, we the prize. But yeah, man, she's always gonna be testing you, little tests, you know what I mean? She's gonna try to do things she knows gets under your skin, things that bother you, just to see how you handle them. Because when women feel like they're in a very, very comfortable place and situation in the relationship, they feel like they can get away with anything. Because right now she's walking all over you. So if she's walking all over you, she can pretty much do any and everything that she wants, and you're, you might, you might, complain a little bit, but you'll let it slide. But Alpha Andy, what's he gonna do? He ain't gonna let that slide. She's the one that gotta slide out. So let's say she stays out late. You don't like that. She doesn't check in. You know what I mean? That's all you ask. Yeah, maybe just check in. Doesn't check in, gets home. Hey babe. Drunk. Oh my God, yeah, it's such a fun time. What you did tonight, oh my God. You're pissed, heated. Boy, do you do? <sighs> it's, it, yeah, it's all good, babe, yeah. I'm so sorry. No, it's fine. No, I'm like, are you mad? Nah, baby, it's all good. Like, just, let's just go to sleep, baby. Come on, let's cuddle. Let's cuddle. That's what you say. So, of course, she's gonna be like, oh, yay, baby. Yes, I'm so sorry. Thank you. She's gonna hug, kiss you. 
cuddle up, be all lovey-dovey, rubbing your head. She might even give you some <laughs> pity cheeks, sympathy cheeks. You don't want sympathy cheeks, bro. You know what I'm saying? Doing that and using that just to manipulate you and control you. When what you should have done is nah, you gotta, you gotta sleep on the couch. You ain't gotta leave. I'm not gonna kick you out because it's the middle of the night and you lit, but you gotta sleep on the couch. And then you gotta get your stuff in the morning and you gotta leave. That's what you gotta do. You gotta put your foot down. You gotta show some self-respect, some self-dignity. Not tolerate things that you've already voiced is not okay with you. If it's not okay, don't let it be okay just because you want her to stay in your life. You don't want her to be upset. Because think about it the other way around, bruh. You do something she doesn't like, she throws the biggest fit, says, no, I don't want to talk to you, goes cold, goes ghost. You over here begging and please, I'm sorry, baby, oh my God. No. Mm-mm. Told you already. She ain't giving you another chance. Why are you giving her? You actually rewarding her for her bad behavior. So she's testing you and you failed that test. She's gonna do multiple things like this. Different little scenarios just to see if you're gonna stick up for yourself, if you're gonna allow her to get away with certain things. She might stick around because she knows that, you know what I mean, she can get away with it, she enjoys it, and she can really talk to Alpha Andy's when she goes out that she's actually attracted to. And that's what leads her to cheating on you. That's what leads her to just disrespecting you, calling you out your name. He's just a friend. Meanwhile, on a balcony in Miami. Mm, mm, mm. Beating the brakes off your girl. That's that's crazy. I'm sorry, bro. I'm just I'm just a messenger. But yeah, man. Um, she's always gonna test you. Don't take it as like ah oh, she's playing games because honestly, the games slow down. They never stop. They slow down when you start to actually pass the test. So stand up for yourself. Don't let stuff slide. Stand strong in your masculine frame. Stay true to who you need to be. Don't fall for the bait, the beta bait. Baby, come here, be beta, please. No, 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 take a break from mouth, Andy. Just be beta for a little bit, just tonight. I'll give you what you like. It's the devil. It's a demon talking. <laughs> Don't fall for it, bruh. You know what I'm saying? Constantly be working on yourself. Constantly be becoming the best version of who you need to be. So that way it just becomes second nature. Anytime she tests you, you pass it with flying colors. Nah, you're not wearing that out. Really, babe? But baby. No, you're not wearing it out. You could wear it out, but we just, we just gonna break up. <laughs> Simple as that. Okay, whatever, I'll change. And then she respects you and then she listens to you. But y'all are afraid to do that. Y'all are like, no, but if I tell her she's gonna be very upset with me. <sighs> Bruh. Do you not want her to respect you and do what you want? Obviously, she's her own woman. She can make her own choices, and that's what you're allowing her to do. But you're just saying you're not going to be a part of the choices that she makes if it doesn't align with the boundaries that you presented to her. That's it. Anyways, I, I think y'all get it. That is it for the video for today. If you guys liked it, please do me a favor. Hit that thumbs up button down below. Also down below, download Attraction Made Easy Masterclass, book you a one-on-one -on -one Zoom call, and until next time, focus on you and the women with two. I know some beauties in Cali, they all be calling me daddy. I know some hoes out in Texas, they all be showing affection.